Om Shanti and welcome back to your own channel. Seek the Sultan Truth Lies Within. We are doing the recording of 25th of April, where Supreme God Father wants us to notice the complete drama and the acting of each of the human beings on this earth. And so as to not get affected by it, watch it like when we watch a cartoon show. So <coughs> it is interesting, it is funny, it is entertaining. And we can watch the whole drama as a detached observer and also keep our dignity. But if we get involved into why, when, what, where, how, then we can get into frustration and irritation. And anger can also be a part of it. So our dignity is lost when we get involved into the questions of why this drama is like this. Why that person is behaving like this. So let's see what does Baba have to say here. <coughs> Baba says, may you be a contented soul who watches the different cartoon shows of Maya and matter as a detached observer. Why cartoon shows of Maya? Because God doesn't want us to think that lust, anger, greed, ego, attachment can have any effect on us. And the world is actually drowning in lust, anger, greed, ego, attachment. So God says it's a very funny show. People don't know what they are doing, what they're getting into, getting involved into. <coughs> and when they do get involved into, they get stuck. They find themselves stuck in it. And when they try to come out, they behave in a very funny manner. So God says, look at it as a cartoon show of Maya. Because Maya is a combination of all these five vices. And it is then each and every human being. And matter, even matter, which is going through upheaval, like weather forecast, weather changes, typhoons, and untimely rain, all this is also an upheaval in the matter. <coughs> so he wants us to watch it as a detached observer, just like watching a movie on a screen. So God says, at the confluence age, Bab Dada's special gift is contentment. A contented soul will experience any situation of upheaval as a puppet show. That means they won't get affected by it. They have become so wise in order to handle situations, handle people, people's behavior. So it seems like a puppet show. <coughs> Nowadays, Cartoon shows are in fashion. So whenever any situation arises, consider it to be a cartoon or puppet show taking place on the unlimited screen. Why an unlimited screen? Because the world drama is going on on a huge screen. What we see in the theater or on a Netflix, a two hour, three hour and a half hour drama is on a small screen. But the whole drama of the earth on the earth on the stage is an unlimited drama on an unlimited screen it is a show of maya because maya exists in this iron age and Kalyug, or matter which you just have to continue to watch while stabilized in the stage of a detached observer The method to become a detached observer is when we are soul conscious and we understand that each soul is an actor, an immortal actor. Nobody's dying. Even if there's a war going on, nobody's dying. Yes, mercy is there. Feelings of mercy for all of them is there because pain is obviously felt when somebody has to die in that kind of state. But leaving the body or the soul leaving a body is known as leaving the body it is not death it is the soul exists even after death the body has been removed from the soul either naturally or by force so god says that this drama has got different scenes don't get affected by it and so as to be stable minded watch it as a detached observer Keep your dignity and remain content. So, when we watch a show, but we get involved into it, why that actor did like this? 
why he said something like this. We can get angry. We can get irritated. So God says when you're watching this unlimited drama on the unlimited screen <coughs> of so many actors, it can be your own family members, can be your neighbors, can be your city people, can be anybody. If you get involved into why, why not this? Because it's an act of Maya. Everybody is wiseful and is acting through vices. So you cannot question when God has given us this knowledge already that Kalyug is full of vices. We cannot get angry with them because of this wisdom. So God says, keep your dignity and remain content and you will then be said to be a contented soul. How do we reach this stage? Is only when we take the complete knowledge. Otherwise, this blessing can seem like as if we have been, we are running away from issues and running away from problems. It's not about running away from problems and situations. <coughs> it's about being detached and able to face situations by being content. It's a more powerful place to be in, to face any situation or any kind of person in our life. How do we do that? For that you'll have to do the same in the course at Brahma Kumaris. And with this, Om Shanti.